Phelps Hot Rod. The green on green. Inject the small block there for the BB family. Tim and the group. Sean Wood out of St. Anselmo. His front engine dragster. Wood's car. Really low, slung. A cool setup there. Both of these cars. Just A+. Plus. BB went 861 in qualifying. Sean Wood didn't sniff 860. He was 890s both times. I mean, and you want to smell 860. Oh, whoa, big move there for Sean Wood. Oh, hang on there, Sean Wood. Get it off center line. BB already rolling off the gas. Goes 864 to pick up the win. Hold. You know, in the Sharon Brothers, that front engine dragster did the same thing yesterday. The second qualifying session. Just wouldn't spin the tire doing the burnout. They labored down the track yesterday. So hopefully the burnout isn't indicative of the same performance that they had yesterday. Chris Bates went 705 in that Bodakian Brothers 23 Ford. You'll see Chris hustle up to run A Fuel and the U.S. Mule Machine here in a little bit. Both drivers are pre-staged. Bates rolls in deep. Green light starts a pair. Hold on there, Chris Bates driving it over there by the wall back towards the center line. And lighten the wind light there for Chris Bates. 7-12, Dodge Ram side of the racetrack. And Rick Norton is former March Meet champion. In Porterville, California, the Gilmore pipe. On a small block there for Norton. Is. Yesterday, Nordis went 860 with a two to qualify in that number two position. The yellow front engine machine over there in the Budweiser CP Carrillo lane. So again, Baker Gas, Baker Gas, you should all be in the staging lanes. If you are not in the staging lanes, well, where are you? Green light starts for both competitors. Rich, left side. Nordness, right lane. Wind light, right lane. Both pre stage, Mike English. Yes, they are. Bendy's in, Brad's in. Here we go. High speed lifts off that throttle. Brad goes 594, 211 miles an hour. That was a good run for the rain.